So last summer, major raccoon problem. We had Big Mama and three little babies. Three of them suckers. They lived under our porch. So we decided, let's try to hunt these suckers. Let's try to kill one. So we, you know, simply made a homemade little shenanigan crappy. So we made that, that crappy trap and, you know, simply put some cat food, a stick. Coon would come in, knock down the knock down the stick, and there we go. We got the sucker in the cage. So we, you know, smoked him out, tried, you know, stabbing him, but I I just couldn't do it. And then one of the suckers got caught on my dog. That pissed me off. So now it's time for revenge. Now it's time to get serious. This is weapon number one. The baseball bat. You know, American pa pastime. This could just really, you know, suck or punch one of them guys. Really kill one. Take out his brain. And then we got the big guy. This is Big Mama right here. Big Mama's gonna feel this one. She's got her, you know, regular kitchen knife. Nice and sharp, you know, to the point. Gonna get that to the point. And we got ourselves a nice little razor. Doesn't seem too offending, but... Once that gets a hold of one of the raccoons. Now our trap. This year, we decided to get a little bit more serious. Took one of our dog cages, you know, nice little sturdy trap. It's got holes in it so I can you know, stab in, get a nice jab at him. Put a string, you know, tied on the door. It wraps around and then through the window where we sit. Once one of them suckers gets in there and starts eating our food, snap! He's trapped in there. He's not getting out. There's nothing else happened. That sucker is dead. There's no more raccoons. See, you kill one, they're gone. It's just a problem. If they're not under the porch, then this is all just a pointless, time-wasting But we'll see, you know. I've been practicing my, my swings, my stabs, my jabs, and I'm ready this year. These coons aren't getting past me. Big Mama is gonna die. Come on, follow me.